Hello everyone, Sydney Storm here, Balloon Twister, Eccentric Entertainer, and what we're going to do today is go over the style of apron that I use, so stick around. Now what I use for an apron, or in other types of industry they call it your jabissiere, where you carry all your extra stuff, um, they're great for magicians or vendors of all kinds, but there is a website called apronman.com and they will customize these for you. The type of apron that I use is called a 6HP. That's right, a 6HP like Papa. Now, what that means is that there's six pockets and the sixth one is a hidden pocket. That uh, if you can take a look right here, if you put your hand towards where your belly button would be and then go straight down, there's actually a little extra pocket in the middle in the back. And that's really beneficial if you ever are in a position where you deal with money or you receive tickets for doing balloons. That's where you can put them. The other slots, you can go ahead and put all your extras. Typically, I save the middle pocket myself for any trash that I happen to have or uh, things like that. And then I might have specific collars in these pockets. But there's a website that I can get these from. I'll share that with you in the link below. And uh, I'll tell you a bit more about them in a moment. But you can customize these to be whatever the way you'd like. I got the normal ties, with just ties in the back, but for about a dollar more, you could go ahead and get either Velcro, Velcro straps or you could get a little click strap and that might make it much easier for you to just put it on there quickly, but I don't have a problem with tying it. So uh, there's other aprons that you can get or you can customize it with colors of all kinds and you can get six pockets or that are all in the front and smaller or two bigger ones or just one giant pocket it all depends on what your needs are as a entertainer busker or vendor or whatever it is that you do that might require an apron uh, if you're in a pinch and you need an apron quickly you can always go to a place like home depot menards uh, any one of those kind of like lowe's any kind of a box store will usually have at least an apron in the uh like the, in the construction area, like if you go to where they sell nails, they're designed to hold nails, but you can always use those uh, for these purposes if you're in a pinch. But if you wanna get one of these ordered, they cost in the neighborhood of about 20 bucks. It's a buck or two more if you wanna get those little, you know, click, click, you know, on the back so it'll buckle together for you. So uh, this is the style of apron that I use. I really like it. I've had these for well over 10 years. They've gotten a, I've gotten a lot of use out of them. They're real durable, and um, it doesn't take long for you to get them. So they'll go ahead and make them exactly the way you want. So if you have a specific costume that might be unique colors, you can go ahead and get those colors to go ahead and match the apron so that way, you know, the apron matches your get up. You can see it's got plenty of room to be able to hold everything that I need. Uh, for twisting the balloons a little spot in the back for money sometimes I'll put a bottle of water up here in the front if I need to um, but uh, I have a, sl a slot for my smaller hand pump which I use for some of the 160 Q balloons and then I have the, the larger pump here for bigger events but this uh, type of apron lets you be really mobile at an event because you see many balloon twisters that might have a balloon station like this with a balloon pump but not ever know how to Get into a position to be strolling it like you might be in a position where you're at a park or at an event where you have to go from group to group or table to table so this is also extremely effective for table entertainment which i did for several years about 14 years i had been doing table to table magic and balloons at lots of different restaurants for ihop applebee's uh, perkins uh, there's a real popular grocery store chain around the midwest called hy V. I operated their kids night for five years so there's a lot that you can do with these types of aprons and sometimes I would go around with little uh, treat like treat bags or something and it gives me a little slot to have those a spot for magic tricks a spot for my balloons and so on and so forth so the, the so so you get the little slots for you know you could, have, you could keep treats in here uh, other items in here like uh, magic tricks and then I'd have slots for my balloons and then a place in the back to put my tips when people would tip me. So these are really great aprons as well. If you happen to be a, a performer from table to table at restaurants or things like that for magician, balloon twisting, uh, different things that they might have you do. So 
this this is available to you through a website called apronman.com. I'm not getting any kind of a kickback from talking about them. Uh, they're not making me any aprons. I'm not getting <laughs> any kudos. We'll go ahead and put their website in the link below for you so that you can check them out. So again, apronman.com. And of course, I'm Sydney Storm. And our question of the day, how do you carry your balloons? Do you have an apron like this? Do you have a whole wall of organized whatnot? There are other people I know that like to have their colors really specific, and sometimes you can find an apron or a way to do that. But please go ahead and comment below because we'd really love to hear from you. And additionally, please go ahead and click like and subscribe. Make sure you subscribe so you can see all of our videos. And again, my name is Sydney Storm, and thank you so much for joining us on Twisters today. Click, click, uh, blah, blah, blah.